got you into teaching? Well, what actually got me into teaching was, um, <laughs> actually, I'm getting divorced. Because, <laughs> <Okay. laughs> uh, well, you know, when I, I just finished my 16th year of uh, teaching at UCSD. Oh, that's, that's, that's awesome. Yeah, and um, the, the reason I got into it was I was uh, working uh, with my, my best friend in San Diego, programmer, and uh, somebody, and uh, he, used, he worked for Microsoft for a little while. And then um, another girl that we all worked at the same company. Mm -hmm. And we all started this group at UCSD, UCSD Extensions. Okay. And we started the VB programming, you know, um, team. You know, it was us three in the beginning. Yeah. And, you know, the reason I joined them was because, you know, when I get divorced, you know, my ex-wife and took the kids to Texas. And I said, well, I need some extra cash to go out there all the time now to see my yeah. kids. And that's actually why I did it. Was yeah. In the beginning, it was because I needed the money. Right. <laughs> that's a pretty big driving force. Yeah. Right. And, and, uh, but now I do it because I love it. You know, I don't do it for the money because you don't make <laughs> very much teaching, believe me, unfortunately. Right. I, I often hear from my – I'm pursuing my master's degree in computer science. I often hear my teachers say, yeah, I have another job to support my teaching habit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it's, it's kind of funny when they say that. I'm like, oh, that's not really the way it should be. But, yeah. you know, okay. Well, the, you know, kind of the way that I kind of see it now when I, I describe uh, everything I do, which is kind of crazy. Right, right. Um, so the, the list of things you don't do is actually smaller. Than the yes, do. very much so. Right. So, the, you know, kind of the way I describe it now is I'm really big in giving back to the community, you know, because I feel, I feel people helped me in the beginning, so I want to give that back, which I've probably done tens of thousands of times by now. But, I love that, yeah. And, and that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to give back to the community. So I look at it as, um, you know, I don't go down to the soup kitchen on Thanksgiving and, you <laughs> right, know, right, I, right, right, right. You know, and do things like that. What I do is, you know, I help people to become programmers, you know, better programmers or programmers mm -hmm. so they can make better money for their family. And I think that's much better than serving Thanksgiving dinner to somebody. Yeah, you know? absolutely. You're, because you're, that's a long term. That's a, right, right. You're you're teaching them how to fish. Yeah. So I mean, you so know, it's very. Yeah, very I, I, and that is the reason I teach and speak and write books and it's all that. It's <laughs> it's amazing because none of that makes very much money. <laughs> right. My job is basically pays the bills. Right. Having empathy doesn't exactly transition into cash. Sometimes. Right. Sometimes. Right. Um, so my job pays the bills. Right. Everything else I do, I do because I like it. Right. <laughs> 